Oh boy, we back at it. Another CC game versus the Seattle Storm. Coming up very soon, I gotta do my pre-game uh, sh uh, show for sure. Make sure y'all hit the like button, subscribe to the channel. Welcome to the Pope B. Frank Show. Uh, so, we know Fever just came off a loss versus the Sky. It was a crazy loss. Uh, and Alyssa Smith let Angel Reese do whatever she pleased. But CC did uh, tie the franchise record with 13 assists. She only had 17 points. She definitely could have had even more than 13 assists. Uh, and in the process of that, all that, that happening until this game, some other BS news then came out with Celeste Taylor being waved bye-bye, which is unheard of, right? Unheard of. Six pick of the WNBA draft, three-time FIBA World Cup player, two-time defensive college player of the year in two different conferences could not see the light of a day on the court for the worst team in the WNBA. Now, how does that make sense to me? It doesn't. You can't pee on my leg, tell me it's raining. More proof they trying to sabotage our girl CC. They would have played together very smoothly. And the fact that you didn't even trade her, I mean, she's tradable. You could have got something for her. I mean, that's why we, do they allow do they allow trades in the WNBA? I don't get it. I don't get it. But tonight, that's neither here nor there. They 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 brought somebody in, some new player. I don't know her name. Lord knows who was her name until she proves herself uh, to be to be a, a somebody who we we realize and recognize her talents. But we'll see. I I don't know how much playing time she might get tonight. We'll keep an eye out on that. But she's a big man, so she's not even a guard. So you're still going to have the Kelsey Mitchells and the Erica Wheeler out there at the same time as Kaylin Clark, which damn near makes Kaylin Clark a small forward when them two on the court with her. So I, I don't agree with it. I don't know what Christy Size is doing. Again, it's hard to say what this team is going to look like or what Kaylin Clark now is going to look like because she seems to have just, I'm a buy into this bogusness. And, and so enough evidence and film and tape can be showed that this don't work. I don't have the fever winning tonight. I got Seattle Storm whipping ass. But usually, always, Kaylin Clark has a good game versus the Storm. So I, I believe she, you know, she's, she scored 20 points the last, you know, her last two games versus them. She scored 20 or better versus them. Plus nine and in, in, in assists in one game, I believe, and seven or eight in another. I think she had 21, seven, and seven, actually, one game. In one game, she had 20 and nine. So she does her thing versus Seattle Storm, and rightfully so. More, more than not, they need her. They need her, right? Uh, because the defense is different. Now they're not playing the lower-tier teams. So the Kelsey Mitchell being able to get off, uh, and Alyssa Smith and all of them and a little bit is a little bit different. They're gonna have to rely on Kaylin Clark scoring for them to be able to stay in the game, to 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 be relevant in the game. So I think we're gonna see our girl get to play much better game, scoring wise, taking more shots. Hopefully she take more than 11, 12 <laughs> shots. But again. This is Christy Side's game plan we're talking about, and Kaylin Clark seems to be going along with that game plan, so, you know, it can go how it goes. But definitely, it's going to be a, a, a hell of a game, I think, uh, uh, say nonetheless. But CC, you know, we see what's going on, and we watching. I'm going to still be there. Live watch party is tonight, so make sure y'all tap in for that. Me and G5 will be live on the watch party doing what we do, keeping up. It should be a hell of a game, no doubt about it. So I'm going to predict CC definitely. She already been dropping a dub every time she played them. I think that, that that saga continues. So look forward to seeing Kaylin Clark with a 20 some point game plus a 10 assist type of game. And and if the Fever can get a win, because Kaylin Clark go crazy and, and play, you know, had an all around game. Rebounds, assists, points, steals, then I believe it can get done. So let me know what y'all think in the comments. Hit the like button, subscribe to the channel. It's the Pope, man. Peace and love. I'm out.